Hi, it's Tree. Okay, I want to show you something about Troy Regis, who is the owner of the Hells Angels Corporation. And this is from USA People Shirts, shirt, uh, USA People Search, a background check. Um, okay, and Troy, you know, and his alias look. Okay, Troy Peace or Troy Philip Regis and Mary S. Smith, aka Troy Regis, Trap Regis. Okay, and then it's got all of his properties in. If you find, if you look through it, if you go to um, just search Troy Regis and you'll see detailed background check. It'll show you, okay, and all his addresses and stuff. And all these houses were used for his international child pornography, human trafficking, snuff film ring, and all his neighbors and stuff. They all know each other and they all live next to each other. And they all, and all the people like his associates and friends, they all share the same addresses as him. And they rotate houses. There's his mom Yvonne, and sister Kim. Anyhow, um, so. You go down and you see all his properties and you can see how everybody's sharing the same addresses back and forth and rotate and stuff like that and how Troy Regas got all of Dave Burgess's property now but really what I want to show you is uh, okay now it just said at the top okay his other name is Mary S. Smith right and okay let's see uh, Where did I go with this? Okay, um, sorry. So it's properties. He's got a whole bunch of properties that he owns. Uh, but like I said, once they got the other wing, they're joined under the Illuminati, under the Queen Elizabeth. Okay, now, these are marriages for Troy Regis, who's also Mary S. Smith. Now, he was married under his name, Troy Regis, to Candace Sickles, okay, in 1993. Now, remember, it said Mary S. Smith, okay, that was his other name. And if you look, okay, the groom, okay, Mary S. Smith is the bride. The groom, Gordon Thomas, Gordon D. P. Thomas, um, uh... Roger Jacob, see Mary Smith is the bride. And um, uh, Joseph Zeno is the groom, and Mary Smith. Okay, that's Troy Regis is Mary Smith, S. Smith. So he's the bride again. And he's the bride again to um, Dwayne, Wayne Dwight McMillan, and Mary S. Smith is the bride. And the groom, David Robert Hovland, and Mary Shan. So he keeps saying Mary the S. 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 Mary different. Still all the same one. These are all Troy Regis's marriages, and the dates. Okay, and um, Stewart or Leslie E. Junior Stewart, uh, aunties Benji Groom. So these are all the people Troy Regis was married to under the name Mary Smith, uh, and the dates. And so basically, he's been married 20 times to these men under the name Mary Smith since he's been age 10. And guess what else? They're all dead. And I was made let to be known that um, his mother did it to make money off of him when he was a little boy because he wasn't making any money off of the child pornography that um, he was born into. And um, I mean, whether, you know, I mean, I was let known about this stuff, but the fact remains, this is legal public documents. You can find out that he is Mary S. Smith and that he is married to all of these men since age 10 and they're all dead. Okay, now what's up with that? Something ain't right there. 20 men and they're all dead. That Troy's been married to under Mary Smith. So 10 years old, you know his mom has had something to do with that. Obviously, okay. Um, all right, so what I'm saying in suggestion is, you know, since I believe he is running an international human trafficking child pornography snuff film kidnapping ring, and I was let known by this, well, I've just, I know, I've known from many sources, and plus, A. Burgess, the world president, and Troy Regis' sidekick, went to prison for 15 years for tens of thousands of pictures of children being used in child pornography, when I've been saying for years and years and years that there's a child pornography ring going on including the fact that I've talked to four children in Reno, Nevada about seven years ago that told me about him and the child pornography ring and what they did to him, what they did to them 
and it's also a Satan cult that he runs, and it's a generational Satan cult. You know, so they also kidnap women and sacrifice them. And Mark Presser in Reno, Nevada, who was, um, he worked at the, as a forest ranger in the um, Reno Forest Preserve. Mark Presser, he knows about this stuff too, and he knows where Troy Regas has two little girls, missing girls, buried under a tree.